Hello everyone, welcome to my kitchen. I'm Valmore. Today I will be making for you a recipe from the Elder Scrolls cookbook. It is a strawberry dessert named after one of the Daedric princes. This is Shiogarath's Strawberry Tarts. Let's get started. The first thing I want to do is make a sweet crostata dough. And that's going to start with AP flour, rye flour, pinch of salt, and brown sugar. And I'm just going to give that a quick stir. Now I'm going to add some cold butter. And I'm going to massage it into the flour until it has a consistency of breadcrumbs. And now I'm going to put in a little bit of water. And I'll put it in a little bit at a time and stir it in to just until everything comes together. And once it comes together, I'm going to form it into a disc, wrap it up tight, and I'm going to put that in the fridge for at least an hour. And now that I've let that sit for a while, I am going to roll it out. <coughs> And I'm going to carefully put it into my pie tin. And now I am going to poke a few holes in the bottom. And I'm going to fill it with pie weights. And I am going to put that into the oven for 15 minutes. For this, I am going to slice some strawberries. I am now going to put the strawberries into a bowl and then I'm going to put on some granulated sugar and I'm going to toss that around and I'm going to let this sit for 15 or so minutes until it starts to release some of its juices which I'm going to save for the next step and I'm going to make a cream for the base of the tart and that is going to start with mascarpone, powdered sugar and heavy cream. And I'm gonna beat that together. So my strawberries have been sitting for a while and there's a lot of juice in the bowl. So I'm going to strain the juice from the strawberries. And into that, I am going to add some port wine and a couple sprigs of thyme. And I'm gonna cook this until it reduces a bit. Now that the crust is cool, I am going to put my mascarpone spread in and I'm going to spread it around. Now I'm going to put my strawberries in. And finally, I'm going to add on some of my cooled thyme and strawberry glaze. So this is definitely more of a summer tart. And right now in the Northern Hemisphere, it is the middle of winter. But if you're able to find fresh, flavorful strawberries, this is still a delicious dessert. And I was fortunate enough to find some sweet and juicy strawberries that become the heart of this dish. The mascarpone spread is rich and creamy and the crust is buttery and slightly sweet with a noticeable hint of rye coming through and all of it's encompassed in the wonderful aroma of thyme. I hope you enjoy it. You can follow me on Instagram or Twitter at chef underscore Velmore. The links will be in the description below. Uh, thanks for watching. Like, subscribe, and come on back next week for another recipe.